Hey everybody, it's Stu Studio. Welcome to another lesson. Um, I have a killer one. I just made a backing track yesterday. We are playing an A minor 7th to an E minor 7th. And what's great about this is that these two chords together share two keys. They can be in the key of A minor, E minor, or if you want to look at it at its relative major would be C major or G major. So you can rip on a minor pentatonic and E minor pentatonic over this two chord vamp which um, it's good because then you can practice working on both scales on one progression and it's a uh, if you haven't done it before it's good exercise and it gets your brain turning so let's get right to the lesson shall we all right welcome to the lesson everybody um, before we get started I'm just gonna show you the chords real easy and uh, you can play two, two, two scales that you're both familiar with. The, we're going to do the A minor pentatonic and E minor pentatonic. And it's, both of them sound great. And I'm going to demonstrate. I'm going to show you the chords real fast before we get started on this. Um, just A minor 7. To an E minor 7. All this track is doing and what what this lets us do is lets us rip on the uh, a minor pentatonic and we can rip on e minor pentatonic and it doesn't matter we can switch back and forth and they they both sound really 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 good so this is a good lesson on switching scales in the middle of a progression so you could be ripping on a minor and then you have to know where your e minor pentatonic box is and so forth it's a good exercise. Uh, so this is combining two scales in one progression. And uh, I'm going to demonstrate it when we put the track on. And, uh, it's, a really, it's like a chill funk groove. Gives us lots of freedom. That's why I picked this track. So let's do it. A minor. E minor. A minor. We got a little slide. So, all right, so that's what's going on in this track. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna start out with the A minor pentatonic, and then we can work in. And I'll show you the E minor. Then we can combine them both. So let's do it. Here's an example of what the A minor pentatonic sounds like.
Wednesday, man. I, as you can see, I was combining both uh, scales in this one progression, and they both sounded they both sounded pretty sweet. I don't know which one I like better. I like them both. Um, so what we're gonna do to finish off this lesson is, I'm gonna put the backing track on, and I'm just gonna play the chords real lightly in the background, and you practice what uh, I was just showing you. Try to uh, experiment with all with the E minor and the A minor pentatonic on this one progression and uh, to, gotta experiment really know those boxes and it's not easy because the, the boxes change you know obviously it's A minor and E minor so you need to know those two those two scales really well and this can uh, help you unlock that a little bit so I'll put the track on for a couple minutes I'll just play the chords and you can practice your scales so let's do it <laughs> 